Todd reading the news stories of Kenny after the shooting in California. He bristles at the mention of Kenny being gay. He thinks it was worded in a way to imply she was guilty because she was gay. This is a problem that happens way too often. Just because you are sensitive to a word does not mean the intent was to send the interpretation to you. I see this way too much on the left. Prejudice, bigot, racist, sexist, misogynist. It depends on the mindset of the person using it, not on the person hearing it. Do not be oversensitive and forget not everyone cares as deeply about a word as you do. It is wrong to assume just because a thought enters a person's mind that that alone is racist. There might be many reasons other than just what you're sensitive about that went into the action that was taken. Thinking before you act, challenge yourself. Is this a rational thought? Are there more than one reason for the reaction you have? Then ask yourself what you should do. None of this is somehow judgment on others, but on the life experiences they have. A few today have a problem over just skin color or sexual orientation. However, if you dress in a way, tattoos or piercings that add to your appearance could cause others to respond one way or the other. That is hardly a wrong thing, after all. This was not an accident of birth. You chose to do those things to yourself. If you choose to draw attention by those actions, you should never fit if you make yourself seem a threat. Tattoos can imply gangs. If you have a huge hole in your ear, pierced lip, nose, then you have chosen to look that way. As for drag, I have no problem with drag, but if you wish to do it, then attempt to do it well. If you go around with a beard, then you are not interested in just drag, but to appear a freak. So don't get upset if others treat you as one. It's that simple. Too many forget the decisions they make that trigger a reaction in others. That is not an accident of birth. While the thoughts are inspired by the book, it does not imply the writer intended to inspire the thoughts I have. The attempt is to start a discussion and get people to think about human behavior from the perspective of the closet. How this might lead to problems that make friends or partners or even business relationships difficult. I can understand why some would dismiss this effort. I find reminders in how the characters behave with memories of my own experiences and then explore that aspect. It's meant to start people to think. It is not meant to imply I am right. If you do not share the ideals with others, then how will you know if you're right? When talking, the focus should be on challenging and exposing your ideals, not in changing other opinions. That would only lead to frustration since the only person you can change is yourself.